YouTube, we're in mayhem here. It's just gonna be kind of a don't do this video. How about that? What I had done is uh, about in October, our septic system, uh, it was time to clean our septic system. So we had it cleaned and the way everything is set up here, I'm using an older septic system, so it's down about three feet. You have to dig down about three feet. Into the ground here to uh, access uh, the tank lids, and there's four in a row. And I had put back about a foot of dirt, and I was going to do some kind of decorative flower bed something like that and I really hadn't decided what I wanted to do and then I got pulled away with different projects and work and stuff and it just I had a couple of feet of dirt on it or a foot of dirt on it just wasn't able to get it finished and then we had a really really bad rain uh, last week while I was out of town this filled up and you guessed it the septic tanks filled up as well because this is the lowest spot and it was just sitting perked right down into it so I had to call the guys to come out again and pump it another 300 bucks because I didn't fill in the dirt so that's that load of dirt that I was going to use for the uh, storm shelter it's going to go here and hopefully I'll have enough to uh, I think that's three bucket loads right there that's fill dirt and then might get one load of uh, nice topsoil go across here so, okay, guys. So now we're back. So, just kind of a heads up. I didn't know that much about septic systems until I've had to have it pumped out twice in one year. And uh, basically, you're making a, a pond, and it seeped down uh, into it. So, kind of a pain in the butt and an expensive lesson for me to learn. Um, if I'd known that. You know, I would have just went ahead and filled it in completely and then not even messed with it, uh, anything else. I think what I am going to do, when the time comes, uh, probably the first of next year, I'm going to have a new septic system put in right here, a few tanks, and then have all of my fill lines go out here. As it sits now, they're going out under there, but they're so covered up. So I'm just going to do all new. It'll tear up all my nice pretty grass and I'm going to cut down a couple of more trees. So we'll have plenty of fill lines and just run it right here. So dang it. The way it is sometimes. You learn as you go. But now I got to dig it back or fill it back in. And why didn't I have them do it? Well, it would have been about a thousand dollars to dig that much back in so I'd rather just spend 300 dig it down myself and have them pump it out and I'll do the fill work again myself tractor would be nice thanks for watching guys thanks for subscribing I know this is just a kind of a completely off the normal stuff that we do but I hope that maybe somebody will uh, not do what I did and save them some money thanks for subscribing